Lenny, what have we got here, mate? What we've got here, mate, Woo. is probably the last of the real performance cars. The last of the big bangers, eh? Big I love it. So car. this is a Kia Stinger. GT. <sighs> yeah. GT twin turbo V6, 3.3 yeah. litre car. Um, beautiful car, driven it. Got the back us with it actually. Out of production now, right? They're finishing now, them up. Now Kia's announced it this year, 2023. Uh -huh. uh, they're out of production now. Uh, and unfortunately, so it's gone the way of the old the Ford Falcon. Falcon. Yeah, so what are we doing? We're waiting for the uh, the electric version of the performance car, are we? Well, the EV6 has, has replaced this the now. The EV6 Kia, which, that's, which goes is, like a score with cat, doesn't the bloody so. But you know, us being petrol what's heads, that, what's that saying you use? Like a dog shot in the you know what? <laughs> <laughs> You're a terror. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit of history here. The Ford year was our last one, uh -huh. 2016. Yeah, right. It was the last Ford, which was a V8. Supercharged car, uh -huh. beautiful car, best car they ever built. And the uh, the Holden equivalent uh, finished up in 2017. 2017. So right unfortunately, the Kia came out in 2017 to replace the, the Commodore and the Falcon. But unfortunately, I think this car, as they said, was. Um, Fortunately or unfortunately? Well, Fortunately, I reckon. It's a bloody great car. I know we missed out on the Aussie stuff, but have a look at it. But it's got a bit of an Aussie flavour, right? Does that, were you telling me earlier something about the suspensions? The suspensions are all developed here in Australia. Right. Uh, for our conditions. That's why they handle better than all the other cars. And obviously the design. Bloody wicked looking car. German design. So you were telling me that the best of breed, right? So they, they poached head of engineering Stryker, out of... Striker, which is the grill. It's named after him. Right. He did the design work Stryker, on the car. Uh, he was the guy... From Audi. Audi, right, okay. Audi. And yeah, yeah, yeah. You can... poached him. Then they poached the guy that invented the M-Series for BMW. Right. And he did all the performance side of the car. As in running gear mechanicals, yeah, yeah, the That's rest right. of it, yeah, so yeah. it's the best of the best. It's mm. a European car and developed on the Nürburgring, you know what I mean? Korean car with a bit of a European flavour and some Aussie suspension to and boot. sold worldwide. Overseas you can get it in a four-wheel drive as well as a front-wheel drive. Like and performance-wise, these things? Oh, under five seconds to 100. <sighs> Fantastic. Very, very quick car. For a car yeah. around 70 odd grand, that's bang for buck, mate, isn't it? It, it falls into the price where the Falcons and the Commodores were. Yeah, and, and I. That's Commodore in 27. And looking at it, that's about the size of the old Falcon 2, just quite, isn't it? Uh, very close, and very close to the old the Commodore. I think the VF's oh, slightly longer. Yeah. Uh, slightly you won't longer. get that for 70 grand. No, but just showing you that was the epitome of performance. <laughs> yeah, back, back in the, the day, yeah. We do, well, we're 30, what's that now? We're talking. 40, 30, 40 odd years ago, 35, mate. 35 years, years ago. Yeah, yeah. Same with the Falcon, you know what I mean? That back end looks good too, mate. I like it. It's, it's a really good looking, car. tough looking. It's got bimodal exhaust, uh, all standard. Bimodal, what does that mean? That sounds impressive, mate. Well, it, it shuts certain things off and makes it okay, a little so bit louder. Okay, so you can bi bypass the exhaust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Right. So the idea being for performance, it, uh, it, it opens up particular gates and off you go. That's right. Ah. Now it's running 19 inch wheels with the real sticky Michelins on it. Mm. Uh, and it's got Brembo's all round. Is that a sunroof on top of that? It's like a, like a moonroof, right? Comes on with it with a, with a whole slides right back. Slides right Gorgeous. Back. It's full cool leather, Napa leather interior. Great uh, looking thing. And look at this, you see these lights on the dash? 60 different colours you can do the dash to it. 60? 60. Not 40, 60. 60. Why 60? What's oh, well, they've got more colours than the rainbow. Oh, it's a rainbow. Oh, okay. You can have every shade that you love, you know what I mean? <laughs> Uh, Keep it, keeps everybody happy, right? Little card stereo in it, yeah. the best of the stereos you can get. I really like it, mate. Can we keep this one? Well, this is the press car, right? This is the press car, but I, I don't want to give it back. No. Nah. Sure now, you, you, you drove this to Bathurst the other day. I know we've got the GT Nationals on, and you took a yeah. Kia GT down there, of course. Yeah, we went up through the Belline Road with some uh, very impressive cars, like W1s and Corvettes and yeah. all sorts of cars. And I tell you what... Kia held the time? Oh. Very impressive. Who would have yeah. thought we'd be sitting here mm. talking and seeing the praises of the Kia, mate? Mate, if you took the in badges off and you put a BMW or you put a Mercedes badge on it, the car'd be 150. You'd be none the wiser. You'd be none the wiser for what it does. It's a lovely you know? car. Uh, I, do, I do like the style of the old, the last of the Falcons too. It's a beautiful car. Yeah. The, and and that, we talked about this last time. Isn't it funny how they they, they got it just right? As they finished them up, it's it's a, it's a bit of a tragedy, really. It but you know, it is what it is. It is. Look, I would say. You ready to go electric, by the way? Not yet. No, <laughs> you can't do it. Yet. It's very hard. That's right. Here we go uh, unleaded or let it in the in the in the veins. Uh, Unfortunately, that it's is the hard. best Falcon they ever built, I think. Well, and, yeah, we talked about the old VFs too. You know, they were the, the best the Commodores. VFs. They finished up with the best the best model. We had, we had a couple out there, mate, and they are the best cars. Yeah. They're running aluminium bonnets and all sorts yeah. of stuff. And yeah. so is this car here. You know? I like it. Uh, technology's there. Unfortunately, just a sign of the times. Things change. It is what it is.
But you know, good, bad, indifferent. You've got to go with the flow sometimes, honey. That's right. You can, uh, mate, you ought to buy this and just keep it, put it, put, tuck it away with your other collectibles, and uh, collectible who knows? Well, next time we might do something on the EV6, uh, an electric car. Have you seen the video on that EV6? That really goes Well, they, they put it against this. They've got a the video out against the two. Like, right. this is the last of this, and that's the beginning of that. Right. And uh, the performance is unbelievable out of that I car. Know, oh, they're, they're it's like, like a 400 kilowatt car. I know. Phenomenal. But, um, Lenny, always a pleasure, mate. Always. Thanks always. for popping in. Thanks, mate.